So this is what, what he was, that rabbi was saying is that we, the religion of Islam, don't uh, forget about Muslims, okay? The religion of Islam is the continuation of... It's played, Muji, so that Sorry. people can see. Should I play it? Uh, uh, yeah, we can, yes. Uh, well, yeah, let's play it and okay. then we will, uh, at least we can play not the whole, but some of them. Yeah, some, some, some of them. Yes, some of the parts, yeah. <clears throat> So anyway, uh, so I, I wish he was actually right. But yeah, I, I wish but I mean that. Uh, no, I said that uh, uh, we we shared that rabbi who was uh, in, in that gathering. He was talking beautiful, you know, like a real, real Jew. So we followed the same uh, commands, the same. Okay, and I think definitely okay, tr true. Uh, I have to say this: that true Christians mm -hmm. also follow the same commands. You know, that we don't have. He was saying we don't have. Uh, war heroes. We have religious heroes. Yeah, that, that's very nice. You know that we, uh, you know God commands us to be peaceful, to be loving. Yeah. Okay, let's play it. Yeah. God, Allah. I mean, is it, it almost seems like it's a different God that they're praying to? No. It's, oh, it's the same. It is the same word. In fact, it's not only the same word. It all comes from the word Al, which means powerful. It, and therefore, the, there are many names for God in the Quran. You'll find not only Allah, but you'll find Elah. I'll explain the difference in a moment. You'll find Rahman, would say in Surah 19, uh, just like in Tanakh. But, but the, the, it's the same, it's the same uh, Semitic language. But it's so close that, for instance, let's take the name Elah, okay? Which means God in Arabic and in the Quran. That word it operates exactly like in uh, in the Ten Commandments. You shall have no other gods on my face. So that word Elohim in that context of Exodus 20 means a false god. And Elah can mean a false god, like saying La ilaha in Allah. There is no God, meaning false god, but Allah, the true God. So we use the same name. The same shorash, the same root, which could mean the true God or a false God. So, of course, it's the same God. And you, I, I just say it, Christians who say that Muslims do not worship the God of, of, of the God of Abraham, when you say that to a Muslim, you are making yourself look like a complete idiot. And Muslims will laugh at you. They they believe not only that Abraham was a prophet who was a Muslim, but not in William doesn't mean if you walk up to Abraham and ask him what's your religion, say I'm a Muslim. That's an Arabic word. It means that Abraham submitted himself before God. And every Muslim believes that Yitzchak was a prophet. And every Muslim believed, in fact, most of the prophets, the 25 prophets in the Quran, were Jewish. And Yaakov was a prophet. So therefore they Believe in the, they believe in the God of many, many prophets, including Abraham, Yitzhak, the Yaakov of blessed memory, and Christians who tell Muslims that they worship moon gods and shmoon gods and all these things. You, I, I really want to save you embarrassment because the Muslims are going, this, this person needs medication. They have no idea what you're talking about. They worship one true God, and therefore Islam has a unique status and great respect in the Jewish faith. All right. <clears throat> yeah. Funny, uh, funny, Muji. I would love to hear what he has to say about all this. Yeah, but the uh, thing is that, no, Martin, and all the verses in the Hadith and the Quran and everything. Yeah, but uh, no, listen, you mix them, Martin. He says, okay, he doesn't say Quran is, uh, okay, I said Quran is perfect, but he doesn't say that, okay. He doesn't, yeah, he doesn't agree with a lot of stuff. No, actually. okay, yeah, perhaps he doesn't, otherwise he would be uh, convert to Islam. But whatever, he said... No, well, okay. I no, don't think but, he would convert. But I whatever. He would be a, a Christian then, because he was saying that he he doesn't agree with Muslims that Jesus is the Messiah and the Christ and everything. Mm -hmm. uh, that he's called the Messiah. Okay. But anyway... Because that would make him a Christian, I think, yeah. if he was a... Yeah, I just, I just would like to say that... Uh, uh, what is it? Um, he believed that we believe in the same God. Okay, yeah, he says that. Right, yeah, the same God, right. and we be, yeah. Look, Martin, 
Even I have heard that critics say many times that, oh, Islam is the copy of uh, Judaism, okay? Because there's the, a lot of similarities, which is in Judaism yeah, and can. Islam, yeah? <laughs> so they say like this, uh, but I don't say that uh, definitely Muslims do not accept it is a copy, but we say it is a continuation, it's a completion. For example, one of the commands of the, the Torah is an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, okay? In Torah, there is no the last sentence. The completion is in Quran, which says that, but if you forgive, it's better for you. So it is the continuation, but a, a completion of those commands, a better, com you know, uh, because Allah says in Quran that if you abrogate a verse, he will bring similar to it or a, a better one to it, okay, than, than that. So he abrogate the, for example, the, uh, previous scriptures and he brought better one uh, of them or similar okay or similar of them